leads five games to three. Ladies and gentlemen, play is continuous. Please take your seats. Call home and tell them to take the steaks off the grill. We're going to be here a while, it looks like. Ladies and gentlemen, seats please. Thank you. These two have been on the court three hours now. Started at four. coming for him up the line. <laughs> right. You know, the very first set of this match, McEnroe was serving for the set at 5-3, lost his serve, but then broke right back to win the set 6-4. That's number three for McEnroe. 30 service ace. Love. Just missed down the center line. That's long. Well out. Low. Triple set point for McEnroe. Trying to get even at two sets apiece. It took Borg five sets to beat Creek to advance to the finals. A good way to end it. Service ace number four for McEnroe and sets are two all between Jimmy Connors and John McEnroe. With Tony Trabert, Pat Summerall at the National Tennis Center in Flushing Meadow, New York. Men's singles semifinals and sets are two all. McEnroe and Connors. Whoever wins this faces Borg tomorrow. But that at the moment is a little concern to either one of them. I'm sure there are a lot of left-handers around watching this that are enjoying the fact you got two good lefties playing in the semis. Thank you. Thank you. I think back over the last few years, uh, left-handers have been the champion. McEnroe last year, Connors the year before. He lost the year before that. Connors the year before. Orantes. Orantes. Borg wants to change all that, doesn't he? I think he has those designs. Good shot by Connors. That moon over Miami? No, that's the sun over New Jersey. Ah. With Manhattan in the foreground. And the borough of Queens a little bit closer. the type of cheap error that McEnroe has been hoping he would get in the past not this match but previous matches Jimmy has missed a lot of those when there's no pace on it he has been very good at handling that kind of shot today <laughs> a 
good controlled concluder that time by Connors. Got up to the ball quickly, had the racket ready, not all the way back. Let McEnroe move out of the corner and just went back in there with his short two-handed shot. for McEnroe first game final set And the game to McEnroe as he wins the first game McEnroe of the fifth the and final set. final set. Time you're looking at exclusive CBS sports coverage of the United States Open Championship of 1980. Semifinals. Either Connors or McEnroe will face Borg tomorrow at four o'clock beginning. Quiet, please. The event to join us late. Borg beat Johan Creek in the first match here in the stadium today, and then Chris Everett Lloyd won the women's championship in three sets over Hanna Mondlikova. Good shot by Connors, stretched out Love wide. 15. All three matches will have gone the distance today. You can't ask for more than that. You get down near the end. Love 30. Love 30. Sun over behind Manhattan. You can see the skyline just barely make it out. No sun going down in here right now. <laughs> no. We've been on the air since 12 o'clock. <laughs> 15, 30. Third face for McEnroe. Connor says none. <laughs> Number six, then. 30 all. That's the first time McEnroe has tried to really break off the shallow wide serve on the first serve in the ad court. You can't hit that kind of a serve as hard. You put more spin on it, try to make it hit up the line so it'll turn more. Oh, he's got him if he makes it. it was he good. made it. And it's break point for Connors. Boy, what a good time for that. 30, McEnroe closing 40. right in on top of the net. Good disguise by Connors. Right over the top, and I think it hit right on the baseline. Looked like it. McEnroe has a service break in this fifth and final set. Connors trying to get it back.
that he thought of calling a baseline was out. He swung at the mark. It came out of his hand and flew all the way across into Connor's court. In the meantime, games are one all. Games are one all.